here we are up to this point now it's accessory time gonna put cleats gonna put our navigation lights spilge pump power switch what the heck else oh i'm gonna do this mounting plate for transducer on the outside and the navigation anchor light pole bang sides are looking good did um olympic deck restore product on that just running some um treated stringers along crossways on the bottom and i'll screw the cedar down to those and i'm in debate of whether i'm going to screw it or to the cross framing to tie it down or just let it free float um I might screw it down in a couple places, pull those boards out, counter bore down and apply a, a fillet material of epoxy and then screw it back in, into the epoxy. Got it done. Uh, I'll take the fine tool and cut those off, the little stringers. And uh, looks pretty good. I'll probably end up Stain it with penithin or something like that just for some protection brother came in to get his boat Brought his pulling platform. This is off the old FS 7 18 FS 18 so uh, We're gonna put a bigger deck on the Platform so I'm on doing the bolts. We'll take some three-quarter AC we're gonna make a bigger deck. It's been in the direct sun outside. This is um, this is two-part epoxy paint, high build, made for metal tank construction stuff like that. And as I said, I don't believe it's got any epoxy saturation on it, other than the paint. So this is ten years worth of being outside. So take it for what it's worth. Doing the install on the pulling platform tower. I think this cost, a, was this a case of beer? Dude welded this up for a case of beer. <laughs> Isn't that a deal? Yep, 